Hi and welcome. In this series of videos, we're looking at canonical content. Uh, canonical content is the uh, content that exists on a canonical page. And a canonical page is defined as a page that has a uh, canonical tag URL that matches the URL of the page itself. These are the pages that you typically look at when you're performing an SEO audit um, because uh, non-canonical pages are unlikely to appear in the search results. In this particular section, we're going to cover pages with less than 250 words, but more than 100. What you'll notice here is that there's a blue thermometer that's showing that this is just data. Um, we say this because it's not really considered an error as such, although in some cases it could be. Uh, there's plenty of reasons why you might want pages that have less than 250 words on them. Uh, but we uh, show this to you just so that you can analyze that data for yourself and make sure that there's no particular issues with it. Next to this, you'll find a drop down that gives you a description of the uh, potential impact that this has on your site, as well as a recommendation about what we would suggest in general, um, which is to add at least 250 words of content to a page. We recommend that we add 250 words of content to a page because that's the minimum amount that Google typically require to understand what a page is about and also give you the opportunity to effectively target the keywords within that page. You'll also notice on here that we have numbers. Uh, we have two numbers here. The first is for the latest crawl and this is for the uh, previous crawl. Uh, both of these crawls were done on the same date, so this, the date is exactly the same. But this is structured um, by the uh, first to last. So we're clicking, clicking on one of these numbers. Uh, you can go through to the page and see um, all of the pages that have a word count less than 250. Um, you can structure this uh, so that you can see the pages by order to see which pages have the most and the least content on them. And we also provide some information about whether these are indexable, canonical, and if they're in the sitemap. Um, typically, pages that are non-indexable or not in the sitemap, as well as not being canonical, aren't pages that you're going to worry about having uh, less than 250 words of content on. So just by simply looking at this data, you can understand very quickly whether or not you're actually looking at an issue. Uh, you can always click the download CSV button, which will download a CSV of all of the data in this table. And by clicking the reporting tab in the breadcrumbs, you'll be able to go straight back to where you were before. Okay, so this has been a brief overview of what uh, pages with less than 250 words of content uh, means. We wouldn't quite qualify this as thin content, uh, but it would be borderline thin content. So I hope this video has been useful to you. Uh, thanks for watching. We look forward to seeing you next time.